<laughs> Mom, are you okay drinking that much? Oh, I'm fine, honey. I'm fine. I'm gonna kill him. What? I'm gonna kill him. Huh? Wait, your dad? Are you crazy? What for? Hey, baby. Yeah, I know, I know. I know, I miss you too. Janice has really been demanding a lot of my attention lately, which is why I haven't been able to get away. Uh, babe, listen, uh, I'll book a little business trip as soon as I can. But I can't wake up my family right now. Okay, okay. I'll talk to you later. Okay. Mommy? Huh? So, why do you want to kill your dad? My dad is cheating on my mom. What?! Something wrong, Greg? Nothing, uh, Mr. Sylvester. Uh, no, no, nothing at all. Yup. Really? Because that was a really big what for nothing. Uh, well, uh, Tommy here just, um, told me something very interesting, if you know what I mean. <laughs> well, um, he, he told me that, uh, that, um, our dear friend Pamela is engaged. Oh. Uh, and... You know, Greg's in love with Pam, so he's pretty heartbroken about it. It's just so tragic. Oh, honey, I'm so, so sorry. Yeah, well, I feel so heartbroken. It feels like I've been cheated on. My life is falling apart. Well, that is a very strong comparison, Greg. Exactly what your father said. The pain of unrequited love is nowhere near the pain of being cheated on. That's something else. Right, Ross? Yep, your grandmother is absolutely right. We're gonna head over to my room and uh, study. <laughs> <laughs> well, do you know who it is? I, I mean, what do you think you should do? I don't know, okay? I just don't know. If I say this truth, my entire life gets flipped upside down. My mom will be heartbroken, my dad will be angry at me, and I, everyone just gets hurt in this. Yeah, very true. But if I say nothing, then my mom is happy, dad's happy, my life stays the same. Kinda, yeah. But my mom would be living a lie. It's, I don't know, it's insane. Well, I think the first order of business is to find out who your dad is cheating with, and I think that will help you resolve a lot of tension for you. And honestly, me at this point, because I am very invested. Yeah, you're right. So, what are we going to do to find out? Easy peasy. I steal my dad's phone and I figure out who he was calling those nights ago. Right, obviously. Because how in the heck are we going to steal your dad's phone? Okay, just play it cool, one step at a time, alrighty? Just stay calm, Tommy. Just stay calm. Oh, you. Here's to you. Oh, and you. I don't like. It's just been so great having you here. Oh, 
Oh, I know, it's just, it's so beautiful out. Mm. This tastes familiar. Oh. <laughs> it's quite old. It was actually, it's from my wedding. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that funny? Special reserve. Oh my <laughs> such a great day, wasn't it? It was really oh. so special. Ah, <laughs> got it. Told you so. Easy. Oh man, I was so scared for you. I was scared for me too. Dad, let's see who you've been texting. Uh, this was at two days ago, 1 a.m. So, jeez, Dad, he really calls a lot of people. Man, are you even like get yesterday's calls? Just one second. One second. Oh, gosh. Jeez, Dad, get a work phone already, am I right? <laughs> oh, here we go. No, 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 Tommy? 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 Hey, buddy. W wake up. Uh, wake up. Come on. Come on, wake up. Uh, oh. Uh, I'm gonna puke. Look at who he's been texting. Your freaking grandma! Man. I don't believe it. I don't believe it. I don't, I, I, I don't, this, this will this literally tear my family apart. Yeah. Uh, I mean, I, I don't think. I think. I don't know. Honestly, I, I don't know. I don't know either. It's going to ruin my mom's relationship with her mom and my dad's relationship with my mom, my relationship with my grandma, my relationship with my dad, and my dad's relationship with my mom. Everybody! Ah! My mom deserves to be with someone who treats her right. Well, well, what are you gonna do? I don't know. I don't know. I, I think I need to sleep on it. I think a major sleep is needed to figure this one out. I'll lock you out. Okay. Dad. So, Grandma left? Yeah, sadly she did. Uh, well, Greg's just gonna head out. Yeah, uh, bye Mr. Sylvester. Bye Greg. <laughs> hey, don't forget, there's plenty of fish in the sea. Thanks. Hey, you gonna be okay? We'll see. I'll get you. I'll get you. I'll get you. <laughs> okay. See ya. What do I do? What's going to happen? If I reveal this secret, my entire life is going to change. But if I don't, I'll be knowingly living a lie. And I don't know if I can put mom through that. <laughs> How could Grandma Monica do this to Mom? To her own daughter? Having an affair with someone she thought was the love of her life? <laughs> what do I do? What do I do? <laughs> Morning. How you doing, sport? Hey guys, um, uh, I got something to say and it's kind of making me sick to my stomach. Um, gosh, this article is terrible, sweetie. 
Can you believe these celebrities? This guy goes out, he cheats on his wife, he ruins his entire family. He's an idiot. Am I right? <laughs> you know what? Stop it. This is a really good article, but some people do terrible things because they're terrible people. Yeah, yeah, sure. Sorry, baby. What was it you wanted to say? Uh, I... Ah, uh, this is awkward. Um, I... You know what? Uh, never mind. Forget it. I'm gonna grab some OJ. <laughs> What's up with him? I don't know. It does seem a little weird lately. Yeah. Tommy makes the hard decision of not telling his mom the truth. He still feels angry with his dad. And anytime Tommy sees him with his grandma, he gets even more frustrated. Eventually, Tommy has had enough. Cheers! Cheers! Woo! Oh, hold on. I have something to say to Ross, the love of my life. I have loved you since the first time I saw you when you dropped the books on the steps at college <laughs> and I had to pick them all up. <laughs> I have been so happy these last 25 years with you, and I look forward to 25 more. I love you so much. Janice, I love you so much. As always, I promise to be faithful and love you no matter what. I want to spend forever. I can't take it anymore! Tommy, I was making a speech! Yeah, sweetie, that, that was really rude. And that's so unlike you, honey. Dad's the one being rude. What's going on with you? What is what is this all about? Dad's cheating on you. Ugh, the words feel so bitter coming out of my mouth. And it's with Grandma. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> what? Is this a joke or something? Because this isn't funny. Tommy, shut it down, or you're going to be grounded, and we're going to take away your cell phone and your laptop. Sweetie, sweetie, he's just joking around. Tommy's joking around. You know what? No. I found out a couple of days ago, and I just... Tommy! I, I thought I could keep it a secret, but I, I just can't live with the fact that your life is a lie. I love you too much, Mom. Tommy is lying. <laughs> Look at him. Fake tears, fake emotions, fake everything. Come on. Is this true, Tommy? It is absolutely not. It is, it's not. Don't be ridiculous. This is not nothing going on. Let me see your phone. Let me see it, Ross, now. Don't you ever baby me again. This is disgusting. How long? Answer me, how long? One year. One year? We made vows. You broke them. I was just... I don't want to hear your excuses. I'm done with you. With my own mother? And you! He's my husband! Janice, I'm so sorry. I lost control. I lost perspective. I, he made me feel young again. Oh, honey, I love you. You're my daughter. Please. Please try to understand. He was my husband. Out of all the men in the world that you could have make you feel young again. Or is that why you chose him? <gasps> I don't, I, I don't even want to know. I'm done with both of you. You are no longer my mother. And you, you are my ex-husband. Get out of here. I will see you in court, Ross. And think about this. This is all on you. You have your whole life to ponder that. 
Get out! But, but I have nowhere to go. This is my house. This is no longer your house. This is my house. Get out. Get out. Don't you look at him. I'm sorry, Mom. What are you sorry for? What did you do? I'm sorry because I should have told you as soon as I knew. I just knew that everything was gonna change after this. Oh, honey, you did nothing wrong. In fact, you saved me from living a lie for the rest of my life. And now I, I have the opportunity to maybe find somebody who really loves me. Really? Yeah. But doesn't it hurt? All of it? All the change? I know you can't look at Grandma the same way, and Dad probably hates me, and... It hurts more than it should right now. But after the hurt comes the healing. And then it's gonna be better. We'll be better. I promise. And yeah, it hurts right now. And I will probably spend the next month <laughs> sitting on the couch, eating ice cream and drinking wine and watching rom-coms. That's fair. <laughs> but after all the grieving and mourning and crying is over with, we're gonna be good, I promise. After every rain comes a rainbow, right? Yes, exactly. <laughs> I'm so proud of you. What you did took so much courage. The truth when you knew it was gonna hurt people that you love. Thanks, Mom. One who should be thanking you. So, so let's get some ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> what flavor do you want? Oh, no, 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 no. You pick. I'll just go ahead and grab it. You text me, okay? Okay, make sure it has chocolate. I'll okay. text you. <laughs> Got you, Mom. <laughs>